Before this video starts, make sure to check out Salad and use this code in when signing up. Hello, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to make an auto updating navbar for every page on your website. So to show that it actually works, I'm going to quickly save this updated file and refresh. Now there's a demo and if I go to every page, there's a demo and all I did was change it in one file, which is so much nicer. Let's get into it. So now that we're here in, so once you're in uh, whatever editor you're using, I recommend Visual Studio Code, it is just the best. What you want to do is find your main page or index and just grab the header, just the whole header. That's all you need to do and also delete it from there. Make a new folder called PHP and name it header.php or header.php and then in that you just want to paste that. That's all you want to do for that. And then go back to your folder, your file I mean, your index, and you want to type in question mark PHP, and then go ahead and close that. Here you want to go ahead and do dollar title equals, then name it whatever. This part will be like the front of your title, so in my case it will be home, and then you're going to want to do a dollar page, this part is helpful for the next episode, and then you're just also going to call that home, but not capitalised, and then you want to do include underscore once, and then find, uh, no, include underscore once, put that in brackets, and then that, and then you want to go and list the directories that it's in, so in my case it will be it will be assets slash php slash header dot php and then at the end make sure to put the semicolon and then we go back to here. Now you see the um, the title has changed to the home and everything is how it was before and now what you do is you copy this PHP code and go into all of your files. So your about me, just remove your header and paste that and rename that to about me. And then change that part to about. You don't want the full name, it's just easier. And then you want to go to projects, well, just do this to all your pages. This one's a bit different because I've already got PHP. And then you just put my projects. And then here the projects. And you just do that for all the files. It's that simple. And the way to get the title part for this is you go back to your header, header.php. And then here, where it says title, you want to write out uh, the PHP tags, and then echo dollar title. And that's it. Is that simple? Yeah. Go down to my comments and check out our sponsors slash affiliates. Goodbye.